Right, let's put that menu down. I wonder if um, the shock is just too much for a little creature. Holy shit! Yeah, I just launched him. It looks like he's asleep though, but it is. That's pretty cool right there, but it did launch the little bugger. Yo, what's going on guys? Riot here playing Ark Survival Evolved today. I am super duper hungover, barely conscious, and I think I broke my left hand. Like, it's severely fractured to say the least, but I, it's definitely not broken. I could use it. So today's just gonna be kind of a cool video where we just look at cool shit. So for starters, Ark Park came out with a new trailer, which looks insane. And then there's some sneak peeks of some creatures, some Godzilla-related stuff that's gonna blow everyone's socks off. And then just to finish it off, this gun in my inventory right here, this first slot in, in my inventory is like the most insane weapon that arc has ever had by far like times a thousand i could safely say that it's gonna blow your if you still have socks on basically they will be removed all right so first let's just show this arc park trailer and then we're gonna watch it again with me commentating over certain bits because there's a lot to talk about it's pretty amazing all right now leave a like and let's get into this Oh my god, I'm so insanely hungover right now. I just like sat here in an empty room for a minute waiting for the video to be over But I just realized the way I'm recording this I could just keep talking right after just put the trailer the commercial in between what I just I was that was very stupid That was not the brightest thing I've ever done right there <laughs> Holy crap, that was embarrassing. All right, let's watch it again. Oh, she's peacock. Wow. It's so anticlimactic <laughs> You expect to see some godly stuff and they just hit you with peacock right there in your face. Not even a warning. Just cock. Boom. All right, here we go, baby. See, that seems risky. Would the Demorphodons never attack the cages? I suppose that just won't be a thing. I wouldn't trust it, though, man. I mean, I guess as long as they're well-fed, they have no reason. See that? What the fuck? Dude was riding a carno and a raptor. Hang on. So they're just all holograms, right? That's what's supposed to be going. That's so cool. A beaver eating a fish. Holy crap. Creatures finally drinking liquids. Man, I've been waiting for that forever. Every creature in this game has the camel, like, aqua capacity of a god. Oh, shiz! This is so beautiful. I've already seen this, like, four times. It's still so amazing. I love having a super short memory span. That's awesome right there. That is just... That's, like, eight kinds of epic. This music is just getting shit crazy. What? What the hell? So you can kill dinosaurs in this place? We cage them to kill- Dude, this entire survival aspect, I was not- I did not see this shit, because so that's just like a specific game mode then. That looks so, like, so much fun. Holy crap, there's this, like, dinosaur, this dragon virtual reality game that just came out. I'm so recording it right after this. I'm so inspired now. Jesus Christ, it's like trying to commentate while watching a movie. It's physically- Oh my god, I squeezed my hand. Like, I'm just too- Oh my god, that shit looks straight up bonkers, dude. Holy crap. <laughs> I gotta be honest, I just like skipped around it having watched it before. I didn't actually like sit down and watch the full thing. I wanted to do it on the video first time. And Jesus Christ, I could have been more of a climactic- Like, I, I'm just- I, I'm having a hard time speaking because I drank a semi-lethal amount of alcohol not like 12 hours ago. But that- that was pretty insane right there. I was gonna say, leave a like if you guys want to see Ark Park on this channel, but there's no way in hell I'm not gonna immediately play that shit the second I have the option. 
There's just no way. All right, and then right here, check this out. This, obviously, I'm not even sure if I'm supposed to be showing this off, but I don't know why Pepe would mind. It's just a sneak peek into some crazy Godzilla stuff. This, so far, as you can see, it's just being animated or crit first. So there's a long process in adding on any sort of Godzilla archetype stuff. Jesus, it is so hard putting words together. It's like I killed so many brain cells last night. My brain's just having a hard time doing anything. It's actually kind of sad, but this is what it's going to look like. This is what uh, Bionic Godzilla is, at least an early sneak peek of what it's going to look like. As you can see, it's still very far along in the process. I mean, even Zilla took like almost two years or something like that, right, to create. Like, that's insane. That's why it's, it's, why it's such a rarity. It's, I'm so excited for that. I'm so excited for that and for baby Godzillas because it's, it's Zilla. It's like Godzilla 1998. That's when it was, right? I can't remember. I was but a child. You know, the one that attacks New York City? God, I really can't hold a thought at all right now. I'm kind of scared. I drove and got breakfast this morning, and it was the most terrifying shit of my life. Like, I should not have driven. I didn't have alcohol in my system, so it was safe to, but my mind is just not there yet. It's actually kind of... I'm hoping it returns. If this does not just feel like a, a hangover. I'm starting to suspect somebody put something in my drink last night. All right, now this right here, this shotgun, is the most insane shizzle on the planet. This is like the MR Rad Tools mod. All the links are in the description below. Actually, it's just this one. So actually, well, the Godzilla mod, if you're not already subscribed to, I don't know what you're doing with your life. So this thing right here, be it a shotgun and the best shotgun known to man. This is it without any attachments right here. Pretty damn sexy, I do say, but its customizations are what makes it so memorable and amazing. So here's the gun skins. We have green plastic, plastic, wood, and modern camo. Where does it appear though? <laughs> there we go, I was already using that. All right, so I already have camo on. Let's check out green plastic. God, that's awesome. Regular plastic, wood. <whistles> Look at that, you can actually have it be wooden. That's so, f I'm gonna leave it as wood. That's, that's just reliable right there. As reliable as a tree. All right, let's put on this barrel. I think there are more attachments as well. I don't think I have them all. Let's see, we have the silencer. We have the flashlight attachment on the side. We have the laser attachments, which we might not be able to equip with like, which is because I have a silencer on what's going on here. No, the laser's just down there. It's in the bottom corner. It's just not visible, but it is that now it's off. Now it's on. All right, let's put the barrel back on. Let's put the silencer back on. I mean the uh, flashlight attachment. Let's put the hollow sight on. That is so freaking cool. So many decisions. I guess we'll go with you, but you match the barrel most. And then we have the freaking stock. Look at us. Choose the color of the stock. I'll go same green plastic. And now you have a much more badass weapon. Look at this thing right here. <laughs> Apparently, this took an insanely long ass time. Like this, this is how you become an ARC sponsored mod right here. You gotta be doing some crazy shit. Let's get it firing with the silencer. Ooh, it's, it's so, yeah. Yeah, it's, you can definitely hear the suppressor coming into play. Wow, this thing barely works at all from a distance. It's such a perfect shotgun, but the closer he gets, the more imminent his death is. All right, let's hear it without the, uh, oops, whoopsie doodles. Let's hear it without the silencer really quick. So I went to here. Oh, damn it, there's so many buttons to press that I'm getting, I'm getting mixed up around here. All right. Oh, yeah, that's a legit ass difference right there. Oh, yeah, it's loud as hell. I feel like I would always have the silencer on just because it makes you feel more legit. Although it definitely sacrifices a bit of, um, actually, does it? I would imagine it does. I would imagine it sacrifices. Stop pressing that button. I would imagine it sacrifices some accuracy though. But it's a shot. It's a it's a shotgun though. You know, what I mean, I don't know. I've just never had any luck in any CODs or anything with silencers on my shiz. Anything that just takes away any sort of accuracy. Although, yeah, you know. But as long as you move fast, you don't really need to be silenced. I'm just trying to think of like this is like COD five right here. COD this is like Modern Warfare one. I'm thinking of. I haven't picked up a Call of Duty in a long time, man. I'll for sure be playing the next one though because I love it's returning back to you know It's supposed to be back to its vintage times Although I don't know what's going on with the new Call of Duty zombies It seems they focused more on putting celebrities in it than anything else. Hang on this right here We also have the shock ammo. Ooh, that is damn sexy So if you also want to tame things you have the ability as well. Right, let's put that menu down I wonder if um, the shock is just too much For a little creature. Holy shit. Yeah, you just launched him. It looks like he's asleep though, but it is that's pretty cool right there, but it didn't launch the little bugger. I wonder it's just a very powerful weapon So if it could if it, if it can knock him to sleep, then it should be able to just knock Anything to sleep, right? It's so perfect. It's just straight up shock ammo. There's No damage inflicted as you can see this is without a doubt if you'd like to rebuttal and challenge me to it in the comment section Be my guest. Oh, he didn't go to sleep, but I don't know. It's, you're gonna take it's gonna take a lot of convincing Look, I knocked his ass out. Wait what happened back there? <laughs> I think that was unrelated. 
The customizations on this thing is insane. It's the most realistic, I should say. Not Maybe not the best, the most realistic gun in the world, because... Actually, no, I would definitely put this as the best. It's just so freaking beautiful. What's that little thing going holographic for right there? What's the poop at that? What's the shizzle? This gun I actually showed off in a video a while ago. I just showed it. Oh my god, I'm never going to stop pressing that. I showed off in a video a while ago. I got like a clip of it being used and it was amazing. So now it's like fully in the game. It's the shits. I love this thing, man. I feel like this needs to be on every ARC server, but I kind of feel like it already is. Yeah, so here's this dope-ass gun that sneak peek at Bionic Godzilla and the ARC Park preview that just came out. Three things we should all be very excited for. Wow, it's not even that OP. It actually took a good amount of shots close up. That's nice. I like balance. Yeah! So today's video was super short, but again, I'm about to throw up. I'm gonna go try and man up and play this new Dragon Virtual Reality game, which looks insane, because Arc Park's given me a VR boner now, and I must satisfy it. Urgh, so she's gonna said anything else, and it sounded so much less creepy. Yeah, so if you had a good time watching, smack that like button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace! Yeah.